New at 9, the haiku stairs, or stairway to heaven, could be completely gone in the near future. After years of complaints from the community, a new proposal moving through city council wants to get rid of it. Chrissy Tamashiro with details. It's been an uphill battle for decades between community concerns and supporters of the haiku stairs. Now a city council member is looking for a solution through a new proposal. City Council Member Esther Kia Aina is asking the city to dismantle the stairs. She says it's something community members have been asking for and deserves to be considered. I would like to think that for all the lessons learned from the pandemic with regard to the impact of uh, unsustainable tourism on our communities, it is high time that we prioritize the quality of life for our local residents. And that is exactly what I'm doing. Under the previous city administration, plans were put in place to try to commercialize the stairs by having a private vendor to take over access to the stairs. I don't know which entity it would be, but someone to take over the stairs, be in charge of the maintenance of the stairs, be in charge of the access to the stairs, and find some mutual agreement. I think it's a fine thing to have and that it should be opened with reservations and somebody in charge. But Kia Aina says the risk outweigh the rewards. It's hard for me to uh, believe that that will be successful. So even if there was a vendor who would be charged with, uh, say, managing this, right, Manage, managing the stairs, that will not uh, stop people from illegally trespassing. Between June 16th and June 30th, more than 70 citations were issued to hikers trespassing on the stairs. Five people were arrested. All the while, Kia Aina says taxpayers are footing an expensive bill. Every year, uh, the Department of Parks and Rec provides $250,000 uh, for special HPD units to provide for uh, enforcement. Uh, for those who are trespassing. Her proposal to dismantle the stairs is estimated to cost $1 million. For now, the city is still weighing its options. The city parks director saying, quote, we believe there are solutions out there that can best balance the desire to maintain parts of the stairway for recreational use, while reducing the impact to the surrounding community, which has dealt with the adverse effects of this closed trail for decades, impacts which should not be ignored. There will be two more chances for public testimony on the resolution later this month. For more information, visit KH12.com. Chrissy Tomashiro, KH12 News, working for Hawaii.